right, folks. This is the latest version on how to update Cody if you have Pulse CCM with Aries. So you're going to scroll over to System. Go down to Aries. Wait forever to pop up. popped up you go ahead and select browse build scroll down to pulse and to your pen in the previous uh, I think it's two three three eight is what I memorized in my previous videos I told you how to copy the link and then just kind of save it in your browser on your phone. That way, uh, when you need it, you just hit refresh. That's the fastest way. Okay. I am running Cody 17, so I am on Krypton Pulse CCM. I select that, and I'm going to do a fresh start first. Yes, I'm sure. Proceed. And we're going to go ahead and let that go for a little bit. And I'll be back with you once it's done. Okay, it's done. You just hit OK. Relaunch Cody. And it'll look like this. Now, all you do to find Aries Wizard and reinstall it again, scroll down to Add-ons. Voila, there it is. Select. Wait for it to pop up, and you're basically going to do the same steps that you did to do a fresh start, only you're going to hit install rather than fresh start. But I'll go ahead and show you that real fast. So you go ahead and hit browse build. Scroll down the pulse. I believe the pin should still be the same for me at the moment. To... Eight. Done. And that was correct. Go down again to Krypton. Make sure that's the one highlighted. Scroll to the right and hit install. You'll get this. Just hit proceed and let it do its thing. Okay. Once it's done loading, it'll ask you this question. If you want to back up, just hit no. Then it'll ask you this one, also hit no. And then from here, like usual, I have always unplugged it and then plugged it back in, but we're going to go ahead and just hit okay. Does the same thing. Then we're gonna open it up again. That's the screen you'll be getting now. And there it is. Just allow it to load completely up and you are done. That is how you do a fresh start for a new version on Pulse CCM with Aries Wizard. <clears throat> and when you always restart it, you'll get this message saying, uh, update, you know, build update. Remember that the date is European. So the first number where it says 11 is actually the day of the month the 11th the next number is the actual month august and obviously the last one is 2017 so the last build update was august 11th 2017 all right laters